Hey, so Gabriel Lazar here from Submer. We're a single phase immersion cooling company and we're trying to bring sustainability into the data center. So we, we think that sustainability is a, a key factor within this, this whole piece. Uh, we're seeing huge energy consumption, which leads to more water consumption as well from data centers. We definitely think it needs to be balanced out. Uh, it needs to be an important variable when, when assuming not just the cost of land and the access to power, but also what kind of impact we're having on wider society and the planet. Uh, so I think an important thing is, is collaboration. So the technology exists to, to reduce uh, carbon emissions. Um, it just needs to be deployed in the places that need it. Uh, and for that, everyone needs to come to the table and, and have those discussions. Yeah, so I think uh, a, big, a big thing that might be missing is inclusion of end users. So the people using those servers that compute um, I don't see them uh, in, the, in the rooms, unfortunately, uh, just yet. And I think they need to be part of it because they also have ambitious climate goals. They, they don't want to be consuming water, um, but they don't have that kind of visibility to see the vast consumption that is going on today. Uh, so that's an education piece. And it's also a piece of, of bringing them into the conversation early on so that they understand the importance of all this. I think we're, we're seeing this as a bit of an iceberg where we're seeing the tip, um, the, the, the data centers themselves, the, the physical presence. Uh, and now we're starting to see that there's a lot more beneath it that's powering our digital economy. So of course, digital economy is not bad in itself. It's very important. It's, it's a huge source of growth for Europe and the world, but we need to use it sensibly and we need to make sure that uh, we're, we're, we're paying attention to the rest of the iceberg.